In today's video, we're gonna be Cerakoting this Taurus G3C, and the pattern that we're gonna be doing today is one of everybody's favorite. It's old school woodland army camo, also known as M81 camo. Stick around, show you how we do it. If you like watching hydro dipping and Cerakote videos, seeing really cool custom stuff being made, and you want to learn a thing or two along the way, make sure that you don't miss any of our awesome weekly videos. Go right down here, hit that subscribe button and the bell notification icon so that you'll get a notification every week when we post something new. So while you're watching the video footage of me actually getting this gun prepped and ready for Cerakote, I'll explain to you exactly what's going on. The very first thing we have to do is strip the gun completely of all of its small parts. I couldn't film that because YouTube's lame and won't let us put that on YouTube, so whatever but the gun's already been taken apart. All the small pieces have been taken out of the inside of the gun. We're putting it in acetone to soak it and get all of the grease and gunpowder residue and all that junk out of the inside and the outside to make sure the surface is completely clean. Then you're gonna see me put it into the oven. It's gotta bake to make sure that there's no hidden oils down inside any of the cracks or anything so we can get all those oils out. If it needs to be soaked again, we will. I don't think we had to for this one, but you'll see the process as it goes. After that, we're gonna move on to sandblasting. We actually put this in a sandblaster. We sandblast all the way back down to the original metal on the slide, and then we give a really good profile on the plastic itself so that the Cerakote will have something good to adhere to. Now, in order to do our old school Army Woodland camo pattern, we've gotta use some stencils. For this particular one, I use stencils from Branson Cerakote. If you're not familiar with Branson Cerakote, they're a company out of Branson, Missouri that does a lot of stuff for the Cerakote industry, but the thing that I use them most for is their stencils. They have awesome pre-made stencils, and they have one in the M81 camo pattern and the Old School Wooden Army camo pattern. In this particular gun, I'm gonna use a mixture of both of them because this one's gonna be completely custom. So if you ever need some paint stencils or some Cerakote stencils, I'd love to link down in the description box below the Branson Cerakote store where you can purchase these stencils for yourself just like I did for this particular project. And if you decide to order from Branson Cerakote and you wanna be just a whole bunch extra, go down in the comment section of the order stream, put something really ridiculous that you want on your package, like me. I requested for them to put a unicorn on my package and they did it. So definitely check out Branson Cerakote if you need stencils. Also, they have a really, really good YouTube channel that covers a whole bunch more in depth about how Cerakote actually works and different processes to apply it. You can check them out on YouTube at Branson Cerakote. You definitely will enjoy their channel as well. So for this particular project, we're gonna be using a total of four Cerakote color. The first one is gonna be our base coat color that we're gonna put over the entire gun. That color is Desert Sand. After you see me put on the Desert Sand, get it tacked out of the oven and back out and it's completely cooled off, what we're going to do is go ahead and apply our first layer of stencils. The other three colors that we're going to be using is Highland Green, Chocolate Brown, and Graphite Black. Once we get done with the gun, I'll be back to give you more information about our Hydrographics and Cerakote services. And don't forget to stick around all the way to the end. We've got all the funny bloopers at the very end of the video, and you don't want to miss that.
So if you are interested in getting some hydro dipping or Cerakote work like we did on this Taurus today, you should definitely check out our website, atfhydrographics.com. There we have a huge pattern gallery of all the available patterns that we have, as well as a link to Cerakote website so that you can choose the Cerakote colors for your next project. We also have a list of all of our frequently asked questions and links to those videos as well and our contact information so that you can get in touch with us for a free quote. So I hope that everyone enjoyed watching us Cerakote this Taurus today. If you like what you saw, make sure that you go below, smash that thumbs up button. We really appreciate it. Also, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks again to everyone for watching. We'll see you back here next week. <laughs> Today's video, we're going to be Cerakoting this Taurus CG3. This is, it is, is it CG3? It, what is it? What is this thing called? So definitely go give them a check out. Go go give them a check out. What was that? Where, where did that come from? Cerakote website where you can check out all the really cool Cerakote. Why do I keep rubbing this thing? I like it's like it's a freaking lamp. A genie's gonna pop. That would be awesome. I would so wish for a day off. Today's video we're gonna be hydro dipping this Taurus G3C. I said hydro dipping, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I just, I just said hydro. We're, we're not cut that. We're we're Sarah cutting today. No hydro dip. Calm down, everybody. Calm down. <laughs> you enjoyed watching the Sarah cut, Sarah cut, Sarah cut, Sarah cut. I don't know why I, I can't talk today. <laughs> <laughs> About how to do Sarah cut, uh, <laughs> and you'll see in the video that I'm using these stencils. These. I'm telling you that I that I've got stencils like I have them in my hands and they're over there on the workbench. Like they're, they're not even in my head. Hold on, try this again, Jesus Christ. The graphics videos go right below. Why does my nose always itch when I'm in the middle of trying to make videos? Ugh. And some hydro dipping or Cerakote work like we did on this G3, is it G3, GC, GC3? GC3, no, C. Oh, there it is. G3C. We did this like on the intro the other day. Like, I don't know why is it so, there's just so many freaking numbers and guns and it just gets confusing and it makes me upset. And why do they, why do they just call it like something normal? Like the, the Taurus, I don't know, the, the Taurus unicorn. You like watching hydro dipping videos, seeing really cool stuff? Cool stuff? Cool, cool. I mean, really, I do this every Freaking week, why? I should not be forgetting stuff. But what? We're watching a Sarah coat this, this, um, this. Oh, we just did this. What is that? It, I'm just gonna call it a Taurus. This is just so much. Just, just a Taurus. It's just a Taurus. <coughs> oh, God. Don't drink Coke right before you film. Oof. Oof. I hope everyone enjoyed watching this. Uh, God, now I know it's called a Taurus. I just, I, I, I want to say hydro dip. We didn't, we, we did not, we didn't hydro dip. We, um, we did the, what is this called? Um, Cerakote. God dang.